Hi, I'm Rajiv Mongia. Um, I'm a thermal architect, which means my job is to try to figure out ways to get heat out of our packages and get them away from the chip. So my work starts at the silicon level itself. The first thing that we try to do is we work with our architects, we work with the silicon designers to try to find ways to design the IP blocks, the chiplets, the package itself, so that we make sure that the heat doesn't stack on top of each other, get too close to each other, and create these very intense hot spots on the package. Now, once we are able to do that, we then figure out ways to put um, uh, lids on the package. We want to try to put this on top of the silicon device, which means we need to have very good thermal interface materials in order to make that connection work. We have some of the best thermal interface materials in the industry for LGA packages, ball grid array packages, anything that you can imagine. But we really don't stop there. <clears throat> what would be great is if we could find a way to take this lid and integrate liquid directly inside of it. So rather than putting a cold plate on top of the package after you're done, let's try to move that liquid into the device itself. So we've been able to find ways to take these integrated cold plates and integrate it completely into the package itself. So that way, <clears throat> when you get one of these packages, it has everything included inside of it. You have the silicon, the thermal interface material, and this integrated cold plate. So at the end of the day, you just basically plumb in liquid directly to the package to try to cool this as much as you possibly can. And this is the way that we're gonna be able to take these power levels, especially with these high power AI GPU products, as high as we could possibly get it in order to extract the highest amount of performance we can out of these types of products.